there is only one place to start with the rest of the Serie A action, and it is, of course, with a certain Mr.'s 1,000th game as a coach. Roma, in stoppage time, beat Sassuolo 2-1 through a Stefan El Shirawi screamer. It was a beautiful goal. One of those goals that kisses the post and goes in the other side. It was so nice. But the celebration, the scenes, Mourinho was down under the curva with all of the players. Kevy's box office. How can you not like this? When I saw earlier in the week it was going to be his thousandth game, I my 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 mind, my brain could only compute that that meant a one 0 win for Roma against the Spolo. I'd forgotten all about the um, the antics, you know, the classic Mourinho antics back in two thousand and four when he went running off uh, in at Old Trafford with Porto, and then obviously. Um, Stefan Al Shawari's wonderful goal, and then off he goes. And I just thought to myself, he has planned that. You know, I know you love I know you love the, the the box office Jose, but you thought to yourself, this is this is week three. You know, this isn't Champions League qualification on, you know, match day 36 or whatever. This is like week three. It's like you know he's made sure he's wearing trainers and tracksuit bottoms tonight rather than... No, sort of no, 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 and no, it's, no. It's just, but it's, I'm, I'm, he's definitely had that in the back of his mind. And he's probably been, the last 20 minutes of the game, he's probably been looking at every attack. Roma go forward. Oh, 72 minutes. If we score now, I can't do it. Oh, Roma attack. Oh, 83 minutes. I think you lost oh, your okay. mind. No, I think he... You, right, think but he every time Mourinho it, does something, people say, oh, he's planned that. <laughs> you reckon he planned for them to be 1-1 against a really dangerous team going into stoppage time and for El Shirawi to pull that off? No, I think he had, in his mind, he had... And I think we've all done it in, you know, whatever things or like... And you think... In this circumstance, I'm doing this. In other circumstances, I'm doing whatever. And, it's, and and it was such a great goal from Skamaka that was only marginally offside. I would have loved that to have counted because it would have just blown that hole. It would have no longer have been a winner. would have looked a li- li- little farcical, which it was farcical in a way. But yeah, I, I think... Roma win 2-1 with exactly the same goals tonight on like 65 minutes. He doesn't make that run. No, obviously he doesn't uh, make the run. No, but... Uh, obviously he doesn't. He, the reason he ran is because of the drama. It was a stoppage time winner. The drama that he wants. No, <sighs> they, won the, they won the match in stoppage time. If it's, he, it's, if it's he, the, hang on, it's shut off for a minute. Of the shut off for a minute. If he'd just stood there and given it a little fist pump, you'd have said, oh, look at him. He's Mourinho. He thinks that he's too big for this win over Sassuolo in round three and he's not bothered celebrating it. No, it's amazing. Because if he'd done that, we wouldn't be talking about it. It's amazing. Yeah, but you, hang on. <laughs> You'd be damn wrong if you think we're not talking about Mourinho every week on this podcast this season. Um, no, well, you, you made that clear when it started <laughs> in, April, in April last year, so... Um, whatever you and Jose have got are going on, I <laughs> you, you can get a I met him in McDonald's when I was a child, and it's left a, a permanent. Did you? Did, did I not tell you the story about the toilets? Right? Did he? No. Did I not? He didn't take you off somewhere, did he? No. Your parents are with you. Yeah, my dad was five feet behind my shoulder. I met Mourinho at the Gatwick Airport, McDonald's. Can we go off? We'll go off on a tangent for a second. Um, so I was a kid, and me, my dad, and a lot of his friends. I think some of my cousins and stuff were there. I've been over to a, a game in in London, and we were flying out that night to go back to Ireland. And we were just at the McDonald's, all sitting at a table. And my dad's looking back at us all and nodding towards the table beside us. And we all just thought he was losing his mind because it was just like a a family at the table, like two young girls, a, a mother and a father. Like, what's he doing? And next thing he starts whistling. We're like, what is going on? And then he came back and he was like, Do you know who's at the table behind you? I'm like, no. It's like it was Mourinho. So I went up. I got sent up because I was the youngest, basically, with a like a pile of Chelsea match day programs being told, get him to sign these. So I went up and I, I must have had like eight of them. 
and I asked him, like, oh, Mr. Mourinho. Like, will you sign my programs? And sure enough, yeah, he, like, he obliged. He signed the first. You, and then I kept turning you, them you to the bottom. You turned into a small Victorian girl <laughs> when you asked him to uh, <laughs> sign the programs. But it was quite nice because I kept, like, when he signed one, I'd put it to the bottom. And the, it was just like a, a never-ending pile, like a a magician's scarf, basically. And when it got to the fourth, he just cracked up and he patted me on the head and he was like, good lad, did you enjoy the match? And he was he was very nice. So, yeah, Mourinho was... I'm, I'm, I'm more disappointed you ate at McDonald's, if I'm honest, but there you go. We shouldn't, we shouldn't be giving the brand any more, uh, more um, airtime. Advertisement. It's McDonald's. Yeah. I don't think it makes any bit of difference. It's not like it's something that m- it might make a bit of difference to McDonald's. Are going to be all right, whether or not we mention them on the Forza Italian Football fucking podcast. Yeah, but I think we're they're they're as evil as Jose Mourinho. <laughs> <laughs> so they're brilliant, effectively. All right. Anyway, moving on. 